Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Sam and I would love to have you guys subscribe so you won't miss out on any new videos. So today I'm doing another vlog, of course, I just love vlogging for you guys and you guys seem to really like them. But today I have a really really fun day, or I guess productive day, I have already had one class at 8 but I didn't film that because I was just too tired to even like bother picking up my camera so it's currently 9 30 I have to go to my office hours for one of my like classes uh in about 30 minutes at 10 and then I have class at 11 and I really want to go to the gym today so maybe I'll take you guys along with me to go to the gym but before that I need to make some coffee and I also need to shower after my office hours. So why don't I show you guys the products I'm going to use in the shower first. Okay, so I'm not really sure exactly what kind of vibe and mood I'm feeling today as far as like hygiene products and what I want to smell like. I also filmed a ginormous Bath and Body Works haul, so I have the box still here. I love the box. I don't want to throw it away because it's so cute. But I don't know what vibe I want to go for today. I'm really trying to use up more of my Bath and Body Works body creams because they expire so soon, I've heard from people. So let's choose one of those out. Let me get that. Okay, so I think what vibe I'm going to go for is I really want to use this Caress Black Orchid and Patchouli Oil body wash. Um, you guys have heard me talk about this in my last hygiene favorites, but I love the scent of this. Like, this is like for sure my favorite. It just smells so good. So I think I'm going to use this and I really want to use a Black Cherry Merlot because it's like a cute little purple vibe. So I'm going to use these two and I don't have the matching body lotion for Black Cherry Merlot which kind of makes me sad because I like to match. But they didn't have it so I think I'm just going to use Forever Red. It's the most similar thing I can find to it because it has like pomegranate and this one is like fruity as well it has cherry and raspberry so I think they they should go together right so oh I think I'm gonna use these three together okay so this is what my coffee looks like I just use instant coffee because I don't have like an espresso or a Keurig or anything so I added some milk in here and the part that makes it super amazing is the Kroger brand white chocolate mocha. The Kroger brand is elite. Like screw the uh, Starbucks one because this one is so good. I'm going to add a little bit more because I love coffee creamer. And I know a lot of people are like, if you put too much creamer in your coffee, then you're not a real coffee drinker. I still like it, okay? So I'm going to mix this up. I have my glass straw. I got that in frame because I swear doing that with one hand was not easy but I just put in some whipped cream and that is my delicious coffee it's very sugary I know but I love it and it's my treat to myself for waking up early today so yeah so it's a little while later honestly my class took a little longer than I thought it would but we're done I got ready I did my makeup my hair and let me just show you guys my outfit because I really like it even though it's super simple so yeah. So don't mind my mess in the background. I have a very messy room, but I'm wearing this black cropped uh, sweater or zip up from Pretty Little Thing. This white like sports bra bralette thing is from Aerie and I'm just wearing some black joggers from Forever 21. They're so comfortable and I think I'll probably wear like maybe my Nike Air Forces or my gym shoes. So that is the outfit. I really really like it. Don't know why I'm like <laughs> bending over like this. I think I want to go to uh, Dollar General and it's a little far from me but we're gonna go because it's for the vlog and I know you guys love it. Also I got these earrings too. I also have to share with you guys a little clothing haul in this vlog so we'll do that when I get back home. I'm at Dollar General. I found the Dollar General exclusives. Or this one's an exclusive. I'm so excited. Let me show you guys what else they have. There's music playing in the background, but they have some cool stuff. It was kind of a drive away from me, but we figured it out. I got here. They have these Vaseline lotions. I've never seen the men's one, which is cool, but yeah this is kind of what it looks like in here it's pretty good i'm happy about my find i want the other one from caress it's like white gardenia but 
yeah they have these jergens um body washes that i've also seen at burlington i saw Catherine talk about them a lot of dove sea knives and some good soft soap i heard some of you guys saying soft soap was really good here are all of the deodorants i feel like i have so many deodorants though so maybe not but they also have these body mists i want to see what they look like and see if i really don't need any more body mist but four dollars is pretty cheap so i'm gonna share with you guys everything i got at dollar general here's my big freaking bag so i didn't get like too too much because I, I, I already had everything there so I mainly went for the caress body washes guys I am on this weird mission to find every single caress body wash there is but I don't want to pay full price for it you know like or I don't want to pay like over the regular price like on Amazon so I'm gonna try and go on a scavenger hunt and find them will I complete this mission hopefully are you guys rooting for me so, I got this one, which is the Caress Charcoal and Pink Lotus. This one is the purifying one for detoxed radiant skin. I thought it looked so cute. Like, it's black because it's, like, charcoal, obviously. Honestly, the smell is not, like, super amazing. kind of smells, like, charcoaly and minty. I don't really get any... Well, I don't know what Pink Lotus is, but I got this. And then I also got... This one, which I'm super excited about, this is a Dollar General exclusive, and this is Peony and Almond Blossom to soothe and unwind. Look at how cute it is. Like, it's, like, so chromey. This one smells bomb. Like, smells so, so good. This is probably going to have to be, like, my second favorite. So, I got these two hygiene products. There's a little hygiene haul for you guys. And I also got beef jerky sticks. A diet Dr. Pepper because I was thirsty. And I also got some lashes, which I needed new lashes because I'm wearing Amazon ones right now. But I got this one by Kiss. They're all by Kiss. And this one is Countess. This is the 3D volume look. And I really like wearing fake lashes. Like, that's just me. I always wear falsies. I have this one in Belle, which I think is cute. And this one in Dame. Hopefully these are dramatic enough for me because y'all know I wear very dramatic lashes. So yeah. And I'm also oh, I'm also just going to share with you guys the um, Bath & Body Works fragrances that I actually exchanged in my Bath & Body Works haul that I posted. Um, I told you guys I was going to return or exchange some. And I just decided to exchange them because why not? So I got coconut and pineapple. I finally almost have the whole collection. I don't really like sun washed, sun washed citrus right now, so I didn't get that. But coconut pineapple smells like a pina colada, and I'm kind of, I'm kind of into it. I really am. So I got this one. I got perfect peony. I don't know why it took me so long to get this. It smells so so good. I'm obsessed with the scent. It smells very fresh and floral, and there's no notes on the back. But I got this one, and then I. I got Dahlia again. You guys know that I hauled this in my previous vlogs and then I exchanged it, but I got it because I couldn't exchange it for a lotion. I don't know why. So yeah, I do like it though. It's very floral. I feel like this one is going to take me some time to get used to, but this packaging though, so freaking cute. So yeah. Some other random things that I got. I got some of these silver hoops from Forever 21. I'm wearing them right now, as you guys can see. But I just got those because sometimes I feel like a silver moment is cute, even though I always wear gold jewelry. Like, it matches the zipper, so I think it looks cute. And I got a white nail polish because I really wanted to get a pedicure because my toes were not looking cute because they didn't have polish on them. And since it's, like, sandal season, I wanted to make sure I had some color on my toes but I didn't want to spend like $30 getting a pedicure because my feet are already not gonna lie pretty smooth because I exfoliate them and do my whole like at home pedicure thing so I was like you know what I'll just buy white nail polish and paint my own toes and save some cash and last thing that I got I got these um sandals from Target and they're size 9 because I have a huge freaking foot that's wide <laughs> One of my insecurities, but I think they're cute. They're just nude and they were $20, so I thought they were good because all of my sandals are so old and 
I just need a good pair of sandals for the summer. And one more thing. Do you guys want to see some more stuff actually? I do have more things. So last weekend I also went to Target and I bought this Dove 0% Aluminum Sensitive Deodorant. I know I have a lot of deodorant. I have deodorant to last me for days, but I just I'm a collector. Okay, you guys, don't judge me, but I got this. I also needed some micellar water because my Garnier one is almost done. And I just got the Up and Up brand, and this is it's compared to Garnier. So I got this one because it was like $2 cheaper. I also got a new beauty blender. This is just by Real Techniques. It's one of my favorites. I, like I say in all my videos, I'm trying to clear up my skin so I feel like I should change my beauty blenders often since they collect bacteria. And I also got some 70% alcohol because I need this for lab. And yeah, so I got all that stuff. And then finally, I went to PacSun and I got this from Brandy Melville. It's just this brown, cute little tank top. And this was $22. So that is my little haul of the day. I know it's very collective though, except for the Dollar General stuff. So yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Really quickly, I just want to share with you guys my new little shower caddy that I got. This is from Target. I posted like a TikTok about it. But I love how spacious it is and that they're like very deep shelves or whatever they're called. And it has a little razor holder. How awesome is that? So I keep some of my bar soaps here. These are like my antibacterial ones. I have my Truly products, a Tree Hut scrub, a Pink scrub, my OGX body washes. I have four of them. Olay body wash conditioner or body conditioner. And then my Tree Hut body wash. And of course my loofahs and a clean washcloth and then of course here I showed you guys this last time but that's my little suction cup um soap bar holder so yeah this is what my shower looks like I'm really happy with the way that it's turned out I think it looks super cute okay so it's a little while later and now I'm gonna attempt to cook chicken I have not cooked this is gonna sound really bad I have not cooked a real meal for myself like actually cooking it besides like pasta and stuff like that in a very long time so i bought some chicken breasts or their thighs i meant to buy chicken breasts but their thighs so i'm gonna attempt to cook it so let's see if i can do this okay so i'm gonna try to make this juicy because every time i cook chicken it's like disgusting and like really dry so i'm gonna hope and pray this turns out good also i hate freaking touching raw like chicken like this but i'm gonna take some salt and I'm going to sprinkle it on here and rub her in. And I saw someone say to just put extra salt because it makes it taste better. I'm going to put on some red pepper, just a teeny bit because I honestly am scared. So my camera stopped recording, but this is how the chicken came out. I think it came out actually really good. It's not dry like it normally is, which I'm happy about. Uh, there's barely any rice in here because my rice cooked kind of stupid. So, yeah, I also threw in some onions. I just honestly winged it, so hopefully it tastes good. I haven't tried it yet. Okay, so I'm going to try this um, chicken. I'm kind of scared. I just get so paranoid that I'm not cooking it thoroughly, but I know that I cooked this one, so... Wait, you guys, it's actually really good. Probably like the best chicken that I've cooked myself. What I kind of did was, honestly, you guys shouldn't listen to me. I'm a terrible cook. But I threw in some chicken broth once I seared it on both sides for like five minutes, just so it can be kind of juicy on the inside. And I created my own little sauce so that it would thicken as it's like kind of just simmering on the pan. But I'm really feeling this. I also have this ginormous grapefruit here that I'm going to eat. So here's to a healthy lunch slash dinner because it's kind of late. It is 5 o'clock. I always start off eating healthy and then at night eat like a bag of chocolates. But I'm really happy. Honestly, if you guys are not very good at cooking, 
just start trying because I feel like that's what it's all about. Like this might look disgusting to some of you guys, but I'm proud of myself for getting out of my comfort zone and actually cooking because it can be really easy just to be lazy. I need to start cooking more because if I'm going to be a young independent woman, your girl needs to learn how to cook. Every woman in my family knows how to cook but me. So yeah. So it's a while later. I did some schoolwork. I feel like I'm always sitting in this spot because my room is just so tiny that there's nowhere else to go. But I figured we could pick out our hygiene products of the day because I've been taking two showers. So I think what I want to try out today is I think I'm going to try out this new Caress body wash that I hauled for you guys. And what scent would go good with that? Let me smell this one more time. Also, I did change because I filmed a perfume video, like an affordable perfume video. That'll be up after this vlog. Ooh, okay. So I think what I'm going to use with this is Magnolia Charm. I think these two would go good together. And I think I'm just going to use my um, A Thousand Wishes body cream it's in my closet i'm too lazy to get it because i'm trying to use up my body creams like i've said a bajillion freaking times and i'm also going to try to finish using up this um baby oil so i'm going to use some baby oil i also just wanted to come on here and like talk to you guys because that's my favorite part about vlogs just being able to talk to you guys so um few things my sister started up her youtube channel so go subscribe if you want she makes really good like fashion videos and beauty videos my sister has super good style unlike me who just wears sweaters every single day but she makes really good um fashion videos i love like her style and so I will have her channel and her new video linked down in the description. Go subscribe and tell her I sent you because I'm an amazing sister, right? Also, let me know some video requests because your girl is kind of running out of video ideas. I know everyone loves hygiene hauls and hygiene shop with me, but you guys, I have so many products that I just don't have space for right now. So I'm going to kind of chill on the shopping even though I did buy two more body washes today yeah i know but i'm gonna try to chill on it and use up all my products first and then buy more um we'll use up some first because i'm there's no way i can go through all of this in <laughs> the month but let me show you guys um my mess right now so this is what my hygiene collection kind of looks like right now i have zero space for all my tree hut scrubs you guys can see i just have hygiene products laying all over the floor i really need to organize that soon maybe i'll do another organization video these are all my tree hut products because i filmed that tree hut video and i never put them back and yeah i'm running out of space i should get another car but i don't have space for it in my room my room is too small for that but yeah so here is my little waxing melt bucket um i keep it in this plastic bin just to keep it organized so these are from target so i got sunset sands i got this one which is like a little mixer so you can mix them i think and then i also got this one which is i don't even know seaside driftwood and this one smells like mahogany teak wood i had um which one did i have I had vanilla cookie crunch melting, but I want to do something different. I think I want to do this one. This is watermelon buttercream by Better Homes and Gardens. It smells like literally like what it says, watermelon and buttercream. So I'm going to put two bricks of this in. So I just broke two cubes. I like to do two and just leave them in here. And I usually melt them uh, for two or three days. There's some loud banging going on upstairs. I melt them um, for about two or three days. So... Yeah, just until I get tired of the scent or I can't really smell it anymore, but this one smells super fruity, so I'm excited. So I just filmed a shower TikTok, and I took a shower, didn't wash my hair today though. But thank you guys so, so much for watching today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe like always. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Bye!